Hey guys, Void19 here with episode 10 of Let's Play Pokemon White 2 Nuzlocke Challenge. Apparently it's spring now, even though I'm recording this in January. Um, yeah, sorry there's a big gap between 9 and 10. I was home for the holidays and doing other stuff. I managed to upload some cool glitch videos since um, I had some free time, so I hope you guys are interested in those. Um, I'm in the next city where I got to in the last episode, but I actually don't know what I'm doing here. So I'm just going to explore a little bit and see if there's a gym here or something. I don't actually remember what the city's called, so this is that train station thing, right? Nimbasa City. Yeah, Battle Subway. Pokemon Center. House. Uh, can't get through there. Uh, is this like the big city with all the battle-y stuff to do? Like you had in the other games? Probably is. The Battle Institute must test your trainer skills. Well, that sounds good. I know I can record battles with friends. Oh, uh, if you beat the champion, come back. Well, that's not very fun. I don't think I've done that yet. <laughs> uh, is that really all there is to do here? What the hell is this place? I feel like someone's going to tell me what it is, but... The Shining Roller Coaster Former Pokemon Gym? Well, I don't want the former gym, I want the current gym. Okay, sure, let's do stuff. Random person to battle, awesome. Last Persephone. <laughs> Alright, well... I guess this will be quick. Level 24 is pretty easy to beat at this point. Well, for some of them anyway. Steve's return. Oh, fake out. Okay, fine. You're gonna be like that? Oh, I think it's fast. Oh, now I can't use consecutive moves. Oh well. <laughs> Doesn't look like I need to use another move. That was... Somewhat easy. Uh, oh man. I hope this was just like a one battle thing, not a stupid mini cutscene thing. No, I'm not scared. Let's just end this stupid. Uh, I shouldn't learn not to talk to people in this game. All that happens is they do stupid things that take up a lot of my time. God, could this be any slower? Good lord. Oh, well that was, um, that was fun. Look, can I battle this person again? That's not exactly something high on my to-do list. Ah, oh, let's look at like Jim. Here we go, gym leaders. The gym leader's never there! The building where you can ride the roller coaster. Oh, God. Why can't I just walk into a gym and fight the person in this game? I have to go on a stupid quest to find the gym leader doing something stupid. This was the roller coaster place, I think. Yeah, it looks about right. Wow. First thing you have to do is to get onto the roller coaster. No way. I had no idea that's how roller coasters work. Alright, let's go. Wow, that was fun. Best roller coaster ride of my life. What up? Cool, which is amazing. Uh, it's one of these things. Great. Let me guess, I have to battle you. No, I don't. Okay. You just have to, like, walk to all these places and press the buttons. <sighs> is there a car for this one? Yeah, there is. Oh no, a trainer! What will I do now? No, you let the car get away. That's all I wanted. Rich boy rolling. Alright. They see me rolling. Let's do this. 
Well, if we just use my normal strategy, just use return, and one hit kill everything. Incidentally, I have no clue what type this gym is going to be. I'm hoping to figure out from the trainers, but I actually don't know. Currently, I'm going to guess electric. I'm just going to switch the order of, um... Oops, I don't want to dig. I want to switch killer with... Oh, that's right, I have some new Pokemon now. Um... Let's just switch with Zubat. And Zubat, Golbat. See what happens there. I want to get some levels on Badass, too. And who knows, maybe I'll level up my Ghost type that I caught last time. Because I feel like a Ghost type would be cool and useful to have. If for nothing else but for the uh, type resists. Come on. Let's go. <sighs> you know, if they want me to battle trainers to do something, they should just make me battle the trainers. Or have the cars already be at the station when I get there. This is just an unnecessary waste of my time. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say this is going to be an electric gym. Which means putting my Zubat at the front of the party was a brilliant idea. Um, let's switch into Onyx, I guess. I'm going to switch into Sandial, but it's pretty low leveled, and I don't really want it to die again. Takedown. Well, that's gonna do a hell of a lot. <laughs> Critical hit did 9 damage. Um, I have Dig, so we'll use that. Because ground is super effective against electricity, as I'm sure everyone watching this knows. I hope I don't get, um, get paralyzed by static. That would suck. I don't know if ground types can. Alright, cool. That was easy. I can't remember if this person had another Pokemon. I wasn't paying that much attention. Smackdown! Yeah, let's name Smackdown. That's awesome. What's it do? User throws a stone or projectile and a flying Pokemon will fall to the ground. I want to fall to the ground, it's weak against rock. Whatever. Alright, well, we'll get rock throw because it's an equal power but of higher accuracy. So, we'll just do that instead. That's a lot of money. Sweet. For all the stuff I can't buy because it's a Nuzlocke challenge. That reminds me, I need to get Pokeballs for the next Mart I find. Whoa, loot! Holy cow! Okay, is this the gym leader that I'm supposed to fight even though this isn't the gym? What's up? Oh, what a shocker. I get here and the gym leader's not here. Thanks for that, that twist there, game. Yeah, it's a little early in the morning. I'm not the most eloquent right now. But we're going to fight a gym leader in this episode. I have decided that much. Well, now I guess I can fight the gym leader. <laughs> How are my Pokemon doing? Onyx has 13 points of damage. Killer has 8. That's not bad. I'm going to move Badass to the front because if this is an electric gym, which I think it is, um... It'll resist electricity, and if shit goes bad, I can switch into my Onyx. Or my Sand Dial, both of which resist electric attacks. Okay, give me my free fresh water. I know it. Yeah, wow, I'm trying to learn how this game works. Alright. Yeah, shut up. Yeah, I know what a Mulga is. That's why my Onyx has Smackdown. <laughs> I actually might be able to use that. Cool. Nimbasa gym. Was this city in the other game too? I feel like it was. But I can't honestly remember. Maybe all these cities are in the other game. It's been so long since I've played it that I don't honestly remember. So level 27. Oh, this is going to be rough. <laughs> I might be severely underleveled for this gym. Leech Seed or Leech Tornado? Let's just Leech Tornado. It's how much damage that does. Plenty. Yeah, I'm not going to take a lot of damage from these guys. Elekid's probably not going to give me too much experience either, because it's a baby Pokemon. 
Yeah, I was kind of hoping for more than that, considering it's a, what's at level 27. Flappy will give me experience, though. Oh, nice. Take down, kill yourself. Ah, oh, almost. Um, I don't want to use tackle and risk getting paralyzed. <laughs> so I'll just leap seed it because I need to kill a turn. And Leap Seed will take it out and give me 1 HP back. I think. Oh, it didn't give me any HP? Wow, they round down. <laughs> Weak. Alright, level 25. Defeated Beauty Nicola. Cool. Alright, now moving on. Oh, I have, a, I have an adoring crowd. Wow. Oh, it's, this is like a runway fashion thing. Oh, god, really? <laughs> really, game? You're gonna do that? Alright, whatever. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Beauty Fleming? Who named someone Fleming? That's like a last name. I think some author has that name. Alright, well, let's just do the same thing we did last time. Leaf Tornado. Oh, that did not do as much. Oh, yeah, I didn't get a crit this time. Right. Not very effective. You suck. Let's Leaf Seed it, because I need an extra turn anyway. Oh, Cotton Spore. Yeah, enjoy that. I'll just heal up all the damage you did to me. <laughs> I'm still faster. Okay, how did that not kill it? Seriously. Whatever, it killed itself. Oh, another level. Awesome. Okay. Blitzel. It just sounds like one of the reindeer. The Blitzer? I think that's one of the reindeer. Alright. Ah, oh, really? I don't think this has static, so we're just going to tackle it. Either way, Badass is kind of damaged, so, yeah. That did not give me any experience, what the hell? Ugh, whatever. Do I risk doing another battle without healing, or do I, uh, go back? I'm gonna go back and heal real quick. Alright, back, just healed. I decided I was gonna wuss out and go back to the Pokemon Center to heal up. So now let's fight trainer number three get slightly closer to the gym leader. I also moved Onyx to the front of my party because I realized it was level 22 and it should probably be a little higher than that if I'm going to use it on the gym leader in case they know something other than physical and electric attacks. Alright, Onyx will use Dig. Ah, oh, slow. <laughs> Whatever. This should kill it. Maybe. Yep. Awesome. Onyx gained 500 experience. It's it. Good grief. Oh, Ampere. Um, the name of the person. I don't know if you're aware. Ampere is a uh, very famous physicist who um, did a lot of work with electricity and magnetism. Um, yeah, nerdy comment of the day. I am a physicist, so I know these things. <laughs> anyway, moving right along, I have defeated the Elekid, and Onyx is level 23. I need to come up with a nickname for Onyx, but I have no idea where the name raider is. Probably would have given some stupid name, like Rocky or something, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, please tell me you're the last trainer. You are the last trainer, awesome. So I totally didn't need to whip out in the heal. Oh god, make it stop. Please make it stop. Oh, dear god. Alright, let's do this. Hi, gym leader, let's battle. Okay, let's go. Nice headphones, by the way. <laughs> Seriously? Good grief. Ah, oh, Pokemon got really trashy in the last couple years. 
Oh no, Amolga, the thing you worried about not using ground attacks on. Well, wait till you see my super special awesome strategy. Go smack down. Oh yeah, Pursuit is going to do a hell of a lot of damage to me. <laughs> oh yeah, super effective, and it fell straight down. Now for the uh, piece de resistance, as they say in French, I think. I hope Smackdown lasts for more than one turn, or I'm going to look like a moron. <laughs> Let's find out if I'm right. Yes! Oh, I am a genius. I am an unmitigated genius. Alright, let's use Stealth Rock here. Really? Wow, you suck. <laughs> uh, God damn, I hate gym leaders and their hyper potions. It's like, oh, you can't kill me in two hits, so I'm just gonna keep healing myself until you run out of PP for dig. Sigh. <laughs> I hope it's still on the ground. Okay, I guess it just stays on the ground for the rest of the match. That is awesome. Now the question is, does it stop being a flying type? We're about to find that out. It does not. Oh, this battle's gonna be a cakewalk. <laughs> Although Onyx did take a fair amount of damage. Because I was dicking around. Um, hmm. I really don't want to lose Onyx because I love the high defense and the annoying matchups it can create. There's no way a Flappy can one-hit kill me, so uh, I'm just going to dig. Oh, and I'm faster than it, too. Awesome. Yeah, it seems like Takedown is the only electric attack it doesn't have. I will give the game props, though. The uh, AI seems to be a lot better than it used to be, i.e. it's not using electric attacks against the ground type. Because <laughs> that always used to amuse me when um, the old Pokemon games would do that. Like, Lieutenant Surge in the first game, if you could get a Nidoking or a Doug Trio or something before you fought him, he would just keep using electric attacks. Keep using Thunder Wave against your ground type. Onyx gained a shitload of experience points, but not enough to go to level 25. Alright, Zeta Strike Go. This guy could probably KO my level 30, dear god, okay. Um, this thing could probably KO my Onyx, so I'm going to heal. Fresh water on my onyx, which, you know, despite its double weakness to water, will feel it to full. Not gonna ask. Uh, that only did eight damage. Okay, this is gonna be easy. Maybe I, well, I had 15 experience, so two hits would have killed it. So I guess that was the right call to heal. Okay, one more should kill it if she doesn't, ugh, I would have a citrus berry. Well. Two more should kill it if she doesn't heal. I'm hoping she's out of potions because she didn't use one on the um, the Flappy. But we're about to find out. Good, no potions. Awesome. Whoa, critical hit. That's not cool. This dig better not miss. Because it's using pursuit, so it won't even matter if I switch out. I don't think dig can miss, but knowing my luck. Okay, good. <laughs> Game just tried to make me a little nervous there. Not appreciated. Level 25. Dragon Breath. I think that's a special move, isn't it? Yeah, it's special, which means Onyx Poop Special Attack won't do any damage at all. Yeah, we're not going to bother learning Dragon Breath. Keep old moves. Give up on Dragon Breath. Yeah, Onyx Special Attack is just marginally higher than its Special Defense. So there's really no point in teaching it a, uh, a medium-powered Special Attack. It's just never going to do any damage. I have one TP for Dig left by the end of that battle, too. It's all the healing. Alright, now I have four of the Gym Badges? Yes, halfway done with the game, guys. Awesome, and I'm still going with my Pokémon. I've only lost, like, five. <laughs> Volt Switch. That is a beast attack. I've played a bit of Pokemon Online recently, and Volt Switch plus Jolteon is like major troll face, but also really good. Um, I'm assuming most of you know what it does, but it's like U-Turn, except it's special. It does like 70 damage, and your Pokemon switches out. It's really good. No. No. I just want to leave! 
You can't. You're not letting me run. That's mean. Although everyone loves me, which is kind of awesome. Shouldn't you have like whited out and gone back to Pokemon Center by now, or is it just me that does that? I remember when they used to say blacked out, but apparently that's not cool anymore, so you have to white out. I wonder why. Because blacking out has to do with drinking a lot? I don't know. Someone in the comments who knows the answer to that question, tell me. Alright, let's heal up, and um, I guess I'll end the episode here. It's going to be a bit shorter than normal, it'll be about 20 minutes. But I got a fair amount done. I explored the city and beat the gym all in one go, so uh, yeah, that'll do it for episode 10 of Let's Play Pokemon White and Nuzlocke Challenge, Void19 saying adios until later, bye.